I ate a quarter, and this is how. Okay, so I was four years old. I had this plastic table and plastic chair set, but the legs would come off. Do I know why? No. Anyways, they were hollow inside. My mom was in the dining room doing whatever, paying taxes maybe, honestly, who knows. And then she had quarters on the table for laundry. Because there's no way a kid could be that dumb to grab a quarter and eat one, right? Anyways, I grab the quarters, then I take off one of the legs of the chair, and I put the quarters in it. I'm stirring them around and it's making noises and stuff, you know, then I look up and tilt the leg back into my mouth. And okay, I know I've been like, you know, kind of like half joking for like the first part of this video, but okay. The rest of this video will kind of be like more serious, you know? Okay, so a bunch of the quarters, they, they fall out onto the ground, whatever, and kind of smack my face, but, but then they hit the ground, you know? But one quarter, one singular quarter goes down into my mouth, straight into my throat. My mom called the ambulance or whatever, because keep in mind, I can like half breathe. I just remember like it didn't hurt, like nothing was in pain, but it was very uncomfortable. And like every time I swallowed, like I could feel that there was something there like blocking my throat. I went to the hospital and then they put me to sleep and then they reached in and pulled it out. You've probably heard of the term open surgery. Well, this was a non-open surgery because you know, they didn't actually cut me open. I've been to the hospital so many times throughout my life, but to this day, that was still the only surgery I've ever had. I've had so much pain in my life, whether it's crashes or cuts, whatever, you know? But this is one of those things where it's like, I could still feel it. Like, I remember exactly what it felt like. And now, keep in mind, things could have gone much worse. Like, if it clogged my airway then I wouldn't be making this video right now, you know? But it didn't, so I'm still here. Um, yeah, make sure to be very, very careful. Do not put anything small in your mouth, especially if you're a kid. Thank you for watching my story time, but yeah, um, this, this, this was a weird one. Cause like, it's not pain, like, like it wasn't painful one bit, but like, it's one of those things where it's like, I still remember exactly what it felt like. And like, I could even feel it now. Kind of like how when um, people get like a limb removed or something, sometimes they say they could like still feel it there, even though it's not that that's kind of like what I feel. Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and uh, peace.